Hello, I'm Andrea, educational psychologist at Lockerbie College. Now that schools are closed due to the COVID-19 pandemic, we thought we'd provide you with some information on looking after you and your child's emotional well-being. Some of you may be feeling very anxious in these unknown times, which is understandable because we're not sure what's going to happen. We're not in control of a lot of things. But there are some things that you are in control of, such as, number one, talking with your child. If your child asks you questions about COVID-19, please give them factual information. Don't over-sensationalise things and adjust the detail to fit their age or developmental level. Secondly, keep routines as routine-like as possible. Of course, with children being off school earlier than planned, you may need to develop new routines. But as much as possible, try and stick to a similar routine every day. For all of us, when we have more predictability and we know what's coming up, then it's going to help allay our anxieties. Thirdly, if your child is upset or anxious, let them know that you're there for them. You may see that your child may have some more different mood swings during this time. Just bear that in mind. One very important thing in being able to respond to your child if they're upset or anxious is actually to manage your own anxieties. One of the most important things to be aware of is that children observe adults' behaviour and adults' emotions to give them cues on how to manage their own emotions and behaviour. So as much as possible, you need to be as calm as possible. Of course, this is quite difficult to do in the current situation some of the time. So you need to look after yourself in order to be able to look after your children and contain their, their anxieties. Limit the amount of news that you watch and listen to. If that's a trigger for your anxieties, just limit it. You are in control of that. Stay connected. One of the good things about social media is that you can stay connected with friends, family, community, via messaging, via video links, many different things. And during this time, check in on other people, look after each other, be there as a support. Another thing in relation to connectedness is that because your child's going to be off school for longer than was planned, you can develop different relationship with your child, share more activities together, get to know them a little bit more. You might even have fun. One of the other important things is if you are feeling panicky or anxious yourself, is to not fight it. To acknowledge it and accept it. We have a tendency, if we feel very anxious or panicky, to attack ourselves. To call ourselves stupid or pull yourself together, don't be so ridiculous. Those kind of thoughts are not helpful. If you're feeling panicky or anxious, take a step back, physically or metaphorically. Take some deep breaths, in through your nose, hold it, out through your mouth and acknowledge that this is a temporary feeling for now. It's an understandable feeling. Just as fear is contagious, so is hope. No feeling is permanent and this too shall pass. If you're a student or a parent of Lockerbie College, then of course we will continue to keep in touch as we always do and look out for an email later that will give you a little bit more detail on what I've been talking about and a little bit more information about looking after yourself and looking after your child's emotional well-being.